So welcome back to our 10th web programming tutorial. Now in this video, instead of actually learning something new about programming, what we're going to do is we're just going to take a look at our web page. Now, as you can see, there's a few things here, but this is just a surface. We can go to a different pages, but again, still, it's just a surface thing. Now, we want to view the page's source. And as you can see, it's got all, everything we've used in it. In the source. So essentially a view source file is the raw data of what's actually can is the raw format of whatever is contained within a web page before the um, browser gets a hold of it and modifies it into what it what output the user will typically see. Now the reason why this is important is because you can actually see comments in here so well, uh, it allows you to understand what the you, what the designer was actually going to do. And if you're working on this with a group of friends and you sent them the web page and they want you sent them the web page like this and or the link to the web page, they can see this, but they might want to take a look at this to see what you've actually done. Now, that's what the view source really helps with. It allows you to find little hidden data that you probably wouldn't have thought would be in a document at this point and the links still work in this instance as you can see we've changed it around and in fact I've um, put the link here around the wrong way as you can tell by the nice little red text here but just wanted to show you that this view source file and I can show you everything that's actually happening to the web page and oh, how the computer reads it before it's translated into just the easiest readable format for us. So anyway, thanks for watching. I um, don't really know much of the point of this video. I was just trying to explain and show you what um, happens, well, what the web page can actually see and how it actually translates to here. So it's really up to you if this video was actually worth watching, but to me it was all about just taking a look, a different look, a more in-depth look into the web page that we've created and how we can actually view it from within a browser rather than from the direct format in Notepad++. So anyway, again, thanks for watching and remember to like and subscribe.